Hello makeup lover and welcome to my channel or welcome back if you've already been here before. If not, my name is Madeline. I'm a Danish makeup artist living in Barcelona in Spain. For today's two different looks, I pulled out an oldie but a goodie, the Blitz Astral Quad Ritualistic Rose. And yes, you heard me right, a Blitz Astral Quad Big Shade. Yes! We got three one year. That was how lucky we were. If you want to see how I did these two different looks, please hang in there and I will show you. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions, comments or good ideas for future content, please put it in the comment box. And of course, if you like videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. It will be awesome to have you join. Now, let's go ahead and do some makeup, shall we? Fit my flat definer into the golden shade and I'm going to use that as a highlighter here under my brow. Dip into the darkest color, the brown color, with my Blender Pro and I'm going to put that here in my crease. I'm just going to gently blend it out. I am well aware that they are all blitz shades, but you can, you can actually use that in the crease too, as you can see, or as you will see. It's very shimmery and beautiful. And I'm just working with it ever so gently and blending it outwards, outwards and out. As you can see, working it in, I use Pat McGrath eyeshadow primer by the way, I forgot to say that. Going in with the other eye primer and this is for the shimmery shades to make them more concentrated and uh, I really want to make them concentrated on the eyelid so this is the intensifies stick dip my ring finger into the darkest of the pinkish purplish colors I'm going to put that here in the outer corner Same thing, dip my ring finger in the same color. Now I'm going to put it in the inner corner. Just going to gently press it on here. And now for the showstopper, dip my ring finger into that one and I'm just going to press it on into the middle of the eyelid. This is like a golden pink color it's so so beautiful I don't know if you can see the shift when I move my head like this gonna put a little bit of the oh sorry <laughs> of the uh, intensifies under my eyes here tipped into the pinkish purplish shade and I'm just going to use the tip of my flat definer brush and I'm going to go like this and make an eyeliner with this color and mix it in with the other part of the look where it's already placed here on the upper eyelid. I'm going to give this eye look an eyeliner. Liquid eyeliner that is, I forgot to say that.
back with a little bit of mascara on and now I'm going to give this look a highlighter and I'm just going to use a golden shade not the one with the pink color in it but just a golden shade back with some lashes on and this is what the first look looks like let's go on to the second eye look for the second eye look I am going to start with the purplish kind of shade in my crease and here as a transition shade I'm just using the Blender Pro, by the way, from Sonia G. I'm just going to blend it upwards and outwards a little bit. On my mobile eyelid, I'm going to put the brown shadow. I'm going to start placing it here on the outer corner and then I'm going to work it inwards. It's a very beautiful brownish chocolate kind of shimmery shade. For the inner third, I'm going to give it the gold color here with my ring finger. And I'm just pressing it on and mixing it into the brown. Pulling out my Intensifies wand again. I'm just going to use it here on the lower lash line as a base for the eyeshadow I'm going to use under my eyes. Dip the tip of my flat definer brush into the brown color and I'm going to use that as an eyeliner here on the first part and I'm just going to mimic what I did on top. So the next color, of course, is going to be the golden one. Same brush, and now with the golden one. Like so. Back with a little bit of mascara on, and this is what it looks like. I wanted to make this look a little bit softer, so that's why I didn't put on an eyeliner. I'm going to put on some false lashes. Back with some eyelashes on and this is what it looks like. I'm now going to go off cam and do a full face of makeup so you can see what it looks like with a full face of makeup. This is it. This is the finished look with a full face of makeup. I'm now going to put my glasses on and go through what I have on my face. As a foundation, I used the Light Medium 8 from Pat McGrath Labs. And I also used the Nude Honey Bronzer to bronze up my face just a little bit. As a blush, I mixed the two reddish pinkish colors from the Bridgerton 2 uh, collection. There was like this awesome uh, blush palette with a highlighter. And uh, as uh, the highlighter, I used the trio and I dipped into the golden and the pinkish color. Now some of you might think mm, it's a little too out there with the shimmery shiny colors all over but I just wanted to show you that you can actually make a look without dipping into any matte shadows with this Blitz Astral Quad. Of course, if it's a little bit too much for you, you can always um, skip the first steps with the transition shades and just use some matte colors instead and keep the shimmery, shining, glittery shades to the mobile eyelid. That will keep it a little toned down um, when you compare it to these two different looks I did. Anyways, I hope you liked this video and uh, if you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments, questions or good ideas for future content, please put it in the comment box. And of course, if you like videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. It will be awesome to have you here. Oh, by the way, 
I forgot to tell you I'm wearing Divinal um, Bella Moore on my lips. Now, all that's left for me is to thank you so, so much for taking your time out of your daily schedule to watch this video. And I hope to see you soon again. Thank you so much. Bye. Mwah.